All right, welcome to my circuit breaker nightmare I've been having. Um, this is an Eaton circuit breaker and it's a GFI and it has an indicator light on it. And I didn't know what this indicator light meant because every time I reset the circuit breaker for my dishwasher, this thing would start flashing. And I was looking at it and looking at it and I go, this has got to mean something. Then I would push the test and it would trip the circuit breaker again. Then I would reset it and then the light wouldn't come back on. So every time my dishwasher kept setting off the doggone circuit breaker, this light would be flashing and it would flash for a while too. So I finally started scouring the internet and boy, I tell you, I had to do some scouring there and I found a link and I'll put it on the description below so you can go to it to see your six possible problems or no problems at all. But anyway, what's going on here is what I had was uh, I had, let's see, which one was it? It was, uh, it was five flashes. So I had one, two, three, four, five on this little indicator here, it was red. And, uh, and then it would stop and then it would start over again. And from what I understand by the uh, description by this link here, you'll go to, it'll do it about 30 times. So that'll give you a good idea of what your problem is. And then I, I went ahead and checked my wiring going to here and checked my wiring to my machine and I made sure everything was good. And then I came back to this breaker and this breaker just keeps on tripping. And it also, when I took it out, it was hot. So that's another good sign to tell you it's a bad one. But anyway, this GFI here has an indicator, it's red, and it'll tell you that there is something, one of these six possible problems here, or no problem at all, but whatever it is, it's going to show up on here. And now I have a link to describe how these circuit breakers work, what they do, and why they do it. All right, folks, it works for me. Good luck, God bless, it works for me.